One of the aspects to this type of match which makes it so interesting is that it can lead to the formation of unlikely alliances. Just another thing to have to worry about when you're competing against three other superstars all at the same time. You have to wonder where these four competitors are mentally right now, heading into what will undoubtedly be an intense battle. And guys, this arena here in Boston is starting to shake in anticipation for this one. The clothesline finds the mark. And uh-oh, looking at Randy Orton. He comes into this fatal four-way with high expectations. What does he need to do to emerge victorious? A Hell in a Cell match is so unpredictable, but one guarantee is that you'll be seriously hurt, and that's what he needs to be ready for. The carnage, the steel, the loss of your own blood, it all comes from that one fact. He'd better be ready. He just needs to just stay alert and buckle up to ride this one out for the W. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. Randy Orton has found an answer here. Just driven down with such power, guys. Randy Orton has found an answer here. Randy Orton thrives on destroying WWE superstars. Orton is cold, calculated, and methodical like no other entity in sports entertainment. To top it off, let's just say the Apex Predator doesn't play well with others. And the atomic drop hits. Looks like Randy Orton has broken a sweat. The fatal four-way environment might just be too much for him to handle. This is nothing, Cole. As this match marches on, he's going to be put through a heck of a lot more than this. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. Ain't no stopping him now. No, he reverses it. This is a man who once was known as the legend. DDT! No doubt about that one. This is Randy Orton's chance. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. Not so sure that was a good idea. Yeah, he might end up paying for that in the long run. Randy Orton is getting ready here. It could be over here. Now with complete control. Oh, and he's just mocking him now. He's also infuriating him, which might not be the best strategy. He's added insult to injury by using his own move against him. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. And here comes Orton. Incoming! The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. Looks like Randy Orton has broken a sweat. It'll be interesting to see how he responds here in this four-way environment. And I guarantee you the other three guys see the predicament he's in and are thinking of ways to capitalize on it. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment here, right? I mean, it'd be crazy for him to think he was going to walk away from this match completely unscathed. Now Randy Orton seems to have lost a step or two. You can't help but wonder if he can turn things around here in this four-way match. I don't like his chances at all, Cole. He's getting absolutely pummeled in there. Well, it's been pretty even up to now, which surprises me a bit. Normally, somebody as deceitful as him has already either cheated his way to victory or been disqualified. He wants no part of the outside. Randy Orton playing it up, but I'm not sure it's the right time or place. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. Can he do it here? Randy Orton is looking very critical right now. There may be no coming back from this. 
I guarantee you that all three of the competitors he's in the ring with right now know that he's likely just one move away. And he goes for the pin. And Orton kicks out. There's a reason Orton is the face of the WWE. Boom! That should do it. Momentum is fully in the corner of Randy Orton now. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Here we go. Coming out of nowhere. What a cut. This could do it. Two. And he gets him with a counter. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. And here comes Orton. Had that one well scouted. Boy, Randy Orton never stops. His signature slam. This one is over. Stops him with a DDT. Big miss for him there. And he'll likely pay for it here. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. He's playing with him now. Just look at this man. He's all business. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. That's uncalled for. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Back between the ropes. The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. He wants it one more time. What a move from Randy Orton. That's how you impress the WWE Universe, folks. The Viper strikes again. I love it. And here comes Orton. The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. Boom! The Viper strikes again. I love it. He's not getting up. You can't like his chances right now. Nice job by Randy Orton there. He's not going to like this. An RKO! Wow, what a... And this has got to be it. One of the aspects to this type of match which makes it so interesting is that it can lead to the formation of unlikely alliances. Just another thing to have to worry about when you're competing against three other superstars all at the same time. You have to wonder where these four competitors are mentally right now heading into what will undoubtedly be an intense battle. And guys, this arena here in Boston is starting to shake in anticipation for this one. The clothesline finds the mark. And uh-oh, looking at Randy Orton. He comes into this fatal four-way with high expectations. What does he need to do to emerge victorious? A Hell in a Cell match is so unpredictable. But one guarantee is that you'll be seriously hurt. And that's what he needs to be ready for. The carnage, the steel, the loss of your own blood. It all comes from...